where the pollinator, which is a little flying weevil, crawls in between the scales to get inside. He gets here because he's in the male cone and that's where all the goodies and the food are, but we gotta get him out of the male cone and into the female cone. So guess how they do that? The male cone thermogenerates, it heats up. It gets so hot and unbearable, it drives out all the pollinators and they fly over to the female cones, which are mimicking the scent of the male cone. And they crawl around and there's not as much food on offer for them in the female cone as there is in the male cone. There's some pollen droplets, but now we got to get them back into the male cone. So the female cone heats up. She thermogenerates asynchronously with the male cone. So they leave the female cone and go back to the male cone, which by now is cooled down. So they get back in the male cone and they hang out. They go back and forth like this for about a week or two until finally they go back one last time into the male cone where they stay and complete their life cycle.